Yi Sun Kiao. This the owner of the restaurant. <laughs> Why he looks like a thief? Hi guys, it's Shiro. Today I'm gonna review Uncle Roger make Thai green curry, which is his 5 million subscriber special. I think he worth it because I really have so much fun watching his video. Let's go and have a look. Fuyo, we just crossed 5 million subscribers. Uncle Roger made egg fried rice, I make ramen. So today, Uncle Roger gonna make my own Thai green curry. Also, I also have a question. Um, I just wonder what is exactly Fuyo come from? Because I only know the Hai Ya. I know that Hai means something not that good in Cantonese, but I think Fuyo seems from Malaysia. Can someone explain to me? Thank you. At one of my favorite Thai restaurants in London, Yi San Kiao. This the owner <laughs> of the restaurant. Why he looks like a thief? John, nephew Tam, how you doing? I'm very good today, Uncle Roger. Let's see how you fare doing your Thai green curry to mine. Hi, yeah, uh, of course it's gonna be as good, if not better than your restaurant curry. Uh, all is in the taste. <laughs> nephew Tam and I actually so much in common. We both love food, and both our wife leave us. Hi, <laughs> yeah, but at least I got custody. <sighs> Uncle Roger trade wife for food because I never catch my food in bed with another man. <laughs> ah, yeah. <laughs> I think these two guys will have a very good conversation. First step, toast your spice. Fuyo, nephew times you have fire. This must be only restaurant in London with no induction stove. Yep, no induction stove, but also the fan of work. Health Hi. and safety no matter here. Hi, yeah. It's so funny. Who need fan? Your restaurant's still here after 30 years, not, 30 not burning then. down. Maybe this will be last week. <laughs> <Ay -ya. laughs> Wipe. And I also like this kitchen because it looks very Asian. It not looks like that fancy kitchen. Peppercorn, coriander seed, and cumin seed. Toast them all until fragrant. Hmm, you smell that a few times? I smell nothing. I recently got COVID. No smell, no taste. <laughs> you got COVID and you still run restaurant. <sighs> Uncle Roger, like, don't. <laughs> These two are so funny. Hey, pussy, just get COVID. <laughs> get it over with. So, Uncle Roger, we've been open for 30 years since 1992. Family run restaurant, authentic Thai food. Nothing's changed in the menu. Hope... That's amazing. Lee will come into Western London and have a try. Ah, yeah. 30 mm. years never change. In a few times, you have to evolve with the time. See, Uncle Roger, 50 year old, I learned how to do <laughs> YouTube. I learned how to use Tinder. Okay, well, I don't want to be Blockbuster. I want to be Netflix. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Ponzi. See, it's turning pink. Oh. Get your pestle and mortar. There are no foreplay when it comes to Thai green curry. You go straight to pounding. Oh my Pour god. your freshly toasted spice in and start pounding. I don't know what the foreplay means until I see the video. Sometimes the ingredients jump up, so you put your hand here to prevent spilling. Very good. See, nephew Nick, this is how you pound. Not your weak ass stirring motion. Hiya. Uncle Roger likes Nephew Nick. Uh, Uncle Roger needs to show Auntie Esther how good I am at pounding. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hey, pestle, careful. Hey, uh, don't pound so hard. This professional pestle and mortar, it won't break. That's not professional pestle and mortar. This professional pestle and mortar. Hiya. When done pounding, pour the spice out. What's the difference? Fuyo, see how fine it is? Are you good at pounding? Nephew? I love pounding. <laughs> Where you learn your pounding? No. In the 70s. Uh, oh, so from magazine? Sometimes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Uncle Roger making one portion of Thai green curry. And I'm using eight chili. Six bird eye chili and two long chili. Chop up your chili. That will make the curry green. I learned your knowledge from my comments. And remember, always eat your chili seed. Next, shallot. Don't use onion. Remember, onion for poor people. <laughs> Garlic. That is so true because I can only buy onion. I don't know why in my province I can't buy any shallot. Is it like growing in the environment that have some special conditions? Not just for the French. Correct. And of course, <laughs> galangal. Another species of ginger. No, it's not ginger. No. Galangal and ginger are completely different. A few times. Mm -hmm. Try it, try it. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. No, we won't do that again. The difference is Kalangkau tastes disgusting when it's raw. <gasps> Add your Kalangkau. Kaffir lime leaf, lemongrass, and coriander root. Remember, you want coriander root, not coriander stem like Jamie Oliver. <laughs> Hiya. <laughs> Uncle Roger. He mentioned so many other people in his video. And I don't know why these two look like they have some real mess. 50 year old now, but my pounding is still good. Pound to your heart's content. <laughs> can last for a long time. <laughs> Love you, lot. You say you can only pound four times. Long time. Love you all day. Love yeah. you every day. That's what your people say. <laughs> we love to say. Feminism haven't made its way to Thailand yet. That their Uncle Roger like that country. <laughs> That's why so many British people have Thai wife. Oh my god, so much pounding. Because British women frigid. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uncle Roger loves pounding in kitchen. I love pounding while hearing other diner eat. As you pound, slowly <laughs> add back your ground spices because it adds so friction dirty. to your pounding. It feels good, it feels better. <laughs> it's like when you wear ripped condom. Add friction. <laughs> add some salt. If you're pounding properly, the whole room should be shaking. <laughs> when you're almost done pounding, add the most important ingredient, the stinkiest thing, shrimp paste. Fui yo! Mm, smells so good. <laughs> the most important thing and the most potent. This is how you scare off white people. If you have white people neighbor you don't like, just leave this at their door. <laughs> scare their whole family away. <laughs> you ever watch horror movie? White people not scared of ghosts, but they scare shrimp paste. <laughs> When people see ghosts in house, they know in haunted house, they still move there to live. But if they know the house got shrimp paste, they fuck off. <laughs> Hiya! And of course, for shrimp paste, use the right amount, not the white amount. Carry on pounding. <laughs> and while you're pounding, you can use this to reflect. He's pounding for like five minutes. On your sad life, why do the people you love always leave you? <laughs> this is Uncle Roger therapy. You go see therapists, they rip you off. All you need is pounding. <laughs> <laughs> I like him. He's so cute. Whew. Half an hour later, Uncle Roger finally finished pounding. Hmm. It tastes good. Now we start <gasps> cooking. My YouTube's figuring go live today. Fuyo. Uncle Roger so proud of this. <laughs> it looks cute, but it, it doesn't look like Uncle Roger. This looks like a small boy. Instead of uh, like uncle. So go buy one to show support. We ship worldwide and it limited edition. So once this sell out, no more this design. <laughs> so finish watching this green curry video and then click link in description okay, to buy. Okay, okay. Usually, first step for cooking Thai green curry is to cook the coconut milk and wait for the milk to separate from the oil. Mm. But nephew tells you use this canned coconut milk. Hi, yeah. <laughs> the oil not gonna separate. It too many chemical in there. I saw this kind of coconut milk in every Asian market. Uh, where your fresh coconut milk? Oh. Where your fresh coconut milk? We don't have any fresh coconut trees here. We can't get fresh coconut milk. Hi, yeah. <laughs> That make a lot of sense. So because the oil won't split, we need to cheat a little bit by adding a bit of oil. Now coconut milk go in. This pot looks so nice. I like the seasoning sound. Let it cook a little bit. Very good, Uncle Roger. Thank Rajan. you, thank you. Now your beautiful green curry paste go in. Now add your chicken. Uncle Roger using chicken thigh. Mm. Always add meat to your Thai green curry because this is not for vegan people. <laughs> Uncle Roger always use chicken thigh for my Thai green curry. Chicken breast fryer that my ex-wife who want to eat. Now add fish sauce. Just use feeling. You want some vegetable? Vegetable? Mm, what kind of vegetable you have? For you? Hiya, munch tooth. <laughs> Why you yeah. give me munch tooth, nephew Tens? This is some Jamie Oliver bullshit. But Thai eggplant, this... But I want to say snow pea sells really expensive in my province. And I think stir-fry snow peas taste good. It's correct ingredient. Pre-soak them in water so they get softer before you cook. Actually, I never see any Thai eggplant. Maybe I'll go to Thailand someday and find it. Next, you add Thai basil, some chilli for colour, bamboo shoot and kaffir lime leaf. 
Ooh. Do no too many bamboo shoot, Uncle Roger. Don't like too many bamboo shoot. Don't fuck with Uncle Roger cooking. I didn't know bamboo shoot can be added into the green curry. I think it could change the flavor. I'm not sure. Okay. Uncle Roger at work. Hi. Uh... <laughs> if your curry too dry like this, feel free to add some chicken stock because chicken stock is like lubricant for Thai green curry. Make sure it's chicken stock and not water. It tastes better. Now, palm yep. sugar. Remember, don't use white sugar. White sugar for poor people. <laughs> but nephew tells why your palm sugar look like rock. It's not fresh. It still tastes good, but it's not fresh. We in England. I, uh, same concept as coconut. I think you should go back to your own country. Hiya? Because you can make better food there, not because I racist. <laughs> Hiya, give me that. When you're almost done, make sure you taste it. And here, a good trick on how to taste. Take a small drop on your spatula, then dip it with your finger. Mm, that's a very Asian way to taste food, but I don't think it's a very clean way. Mm, good. Try, try. Mm. Mm. I think a bit more fish sauce, a bit more. Yeah. Yeah, when you're cooking, always taste it. Always taste when you cook. But <laughs> Uncle Roger feel I still missing some important thing. What could it be, nephew Thames? Ah, yeah. MSG. The magic white powder. MSG Fuyo. <laughs> Why you put this on there? Just open the whole thing. You don't need <laughs> oh this my. shaker bullshit. Just go. Use feeling. Use feeling. <laughs> you very feeling, you're not feeling. So much feeling. No <laughs> such thing as too much MSG. <laughs> I think that's If any too MSG much. brand want to sponsor Uncle Roger, hit <laughs> me up, taste it a bit more. But I don't know why. I remember a friend told me that MSG is actually doesn't have the flavor itself. It's just make every other ingredient taste better. I don't know whether it is true or not. Oh! Mm. Tastes like magic now. I think we're ready. Yeah. Turn off heat. And now it's ready to serve. Whew. Okay, look, look how nice my Thai green curry is. Look at the beautiful green oil on top. Well, it's all in the taste. Let's try. Okay. Get some rice first. Thank you so much, Uncle Roger. Of course, Let's no worry. See how your tense. green curry has turned out to be. Just taste. trying to help your Thai restaurant. Don't want it to close <laughs> down. Oh, kapun kap, kapun kap. Mm, look at this. This curry is so much oil, I think America is going to invade it. <laughs> mm. Mm. It's good. Mm. Good spice. Mm. Mm, not bad, Uncle Roger. Mm. Mm, actually, really good. Mm. Uncle Roger, thumbs up. Definitely. Thank you, thank you, nephew. Mm -hmm. At least this man has full of knowledge. Look at mine anytime. If you like good Thai food, come to Yi San Kiao. Come say hi to nephew Thames. Uncle Roger's favorite dish here is the Northeast style catfish, the son in law egg, and of course, the Thai green curry. Come visit us, Isan Kyo, in Shepherd's Bush. This dish just looks so tasty. Oh my god. They're gonna have Uncle Roger's special Thai green curry with extra MSG. <laughs> Fuyo! Thank you, niece and nephew, for 5 million subscribers. You make Uncle Roger feel so special. You make me feel Bye bye. Not Thai. I know, I just throw it in Why there. Why you keep man. cultural appropriation? <laughs> <laughs> I know the Scandinese. <laughs> That's not loud enough, is it? <laughs> this is only. Western people do not understand, so it's okay. Restaurant in London with no induction stove. But find the work here. Induction no needed. If you're gonna do the broken English, you're gonna have to really? do it the whole video. Fuck that then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone cooking will watch. Yeah, see. Do it the whole video. Fuck that then. This yeah, guy yeah. also will <laughs> watch. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna burn it down before yeah. next week. <laughs> right, we'll do that. Do that. Take again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sure, sure. Uh, oh, it's burning now. Fuck, 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 fuck. fuck. <laughs> yeah, it's so easy to burn. I burn a lot of time as well. Yeah. yeah. You know, nephew Thames and I have so much in common. We both love food and both our wife leave us. <laughs> but food tastes better than wife. It depends on the wife. I think your wife got bad hygiene. <laughs> oh <laughs> my <laughs> god! <laughs> it's okay. Sometimes it's crushing. <laughs> that is so dirty! 
Uncle <laughs> Roger, go only only go tell a woman if they have trust. Ah. Extra flavor. Oh, <laughs> because no. British woman frigid. Opposite. Ah. <laughs> Need to be flexible, man. <laughs> They're so funny, but <laughs> I'm gonna get so much hate. No, no, it's okay. Found a way. I'm too old for that now. I uh, never too old for pounding. <laughs> Do you need Viagra when you pound? I never <laughs> use Viagra. Really? Yeah, I use spicy chili. Spicy chili when you pound? One pick lasts you long time. That woman going gonna go to hospital. <laughs> <laughs> I remember I read the news that a singer put the chili jam into the condom and I was totally shocked. <laughs> I do really good, man. It's fine. Uh, <laughs> I think it's an extra MSG, you know. Yeah, that it is. Really adds that. You, know? <laughs> <laughs> you went down. Yeah. Good. This video is so funny. Thank you for watching. This is so funny and so sorry for children. And don't forget to give me a like or subscribe. Thank you and goodbye. See you next time. <laughs>